Hi Gemini, I'm here to do your love messages for the remainder of June going into July. I've got the cards pulled. Let's go ahead and jump into it. It's going to be a quick read. Uh, thank you to those who have liked, shared, commented, subscribed to the channel. Thank you to those who have requested personal readings. All of my information is below. Find me on Instago where you can ask a question or two. Um, comment below. I'm going to choose two uh, commenters and um, give two people a free reading. So uh, go ahead and do that. Okay, so we have the Five of Wands, the Six of Swords, the Nine of Cups, Knight of Wands, King of Swords. Bottom of the deck, Four of Wands. Okay, so of course, th this is love messages. And we've got the Four of Wands, talks about home and happiness and uh, stability here surrounding a relationship. And it, it could be family, it could be romantic. There was conflict here, but it looks like there's there's a little bit of peace here. And you guys are getting some wish fulfillment. Maybe with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This still may be a bit... This there's, So the passion has been reignited here for some of my Geminis. Which is, it looks like what you guys have wished for. Um, and you're getting that wish fulfillment. And it sets you in a place where... Um, you could be dealing with another air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, like yourself. Typically, this is Libra or Aquarius. Um, the passion could be reignited with an Aquarius. An Aquarius. Oh, I said an Aquarius. An air sign person. Some of you could be with an Aquarius, but. Or you're wanting to be passionate with someone, but they're kind of standoffish. This person is in contemplation. Uh, know that they're always thinking. They're 10 steps ahead of most people around them. At least 10 steps. Sometimes 20. Um, they're always thinking. They're constantly going in their, in their mind. Um, Gemini. A lot of times Gemini comes up as a fire sign. You guys may want to have that passion and that passion with someone. Somebody's being real cold here. But it's peace. And the King of Swords is pretty quiet. Pretty peaceful. But it's. Um, it's not a lot of. You want the passion reignited here. But it's not a lot for some of you. But right now it's quiet. And some of you. Could be just dealing with a King of Swords type of person. Where they're just kind of cold kind of distant in a sense um, for some of you you're moving away from there's like the five of swords some interference um, maybe some you know third party situation you're moving away from arguing and bickering about that type of situation moving to more placid state of mind peaceful in the home this is wish fulfillment for yourself and others involved or the other involved. Now you're wanting to be passionate. And then some of you are questioning, is this person in and out? Are they... Are they genuine? Or, or vice versa, someone's questioning that about you in regards to a relationship. So, peace, and it's what you wish for. Trying to restore the passion with, with a cold person, though. Someone who's really cold. All right, uh, request a personal reading if you feel like this resonated with you. Like, share, comment, subscribe. It's much appreciated. Remember to stay in prayer. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.